Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our tech is and in this video I'm gonna show you how to fix a dead Motorola Z3 phones and this method will also work on Motorola Z4, Z4 Plus, Z5, Z5 Plus. These are the same methods which you can try there. So first of all you require to download these three files from the given link below the description. The first one is the Motorola device manager for the drivers stock room of Motorola Z3, Z4 whichever phone you have and the third one is the ADB fast boot for file. So it is these are the commands here and I also made a bad file of this command that will helps to automatically uh, give all the commands. So first of all uh, copy this uh, ADB uh, files of ADB folder and simply copy it to the uh, copy that all the files and simply uh, paste it to fast stock room folder so here it is g3 model and simply paste over here and i also have the uh, here it is the, the bat file for all the commands which i have made so simply copy and paste also this bat file here and all the uh, uh, links are below the description you can check it out there so now the main method is started so now you require the original cable which comes with the phone or any high quality cable then hold the uh, power button and the volume down for five to eight seconds and your phone will jump on this bootloader screen so here it is uh, your, your your phone will be jump on that screen and make sure your uh, your battery charge must be above 80 percent okay if your uh, battery was like uh, <laughs> below uh, 70 or 50 it might be uh, again uh, you face it might not work because uh, sometime the commands not takes if the battery percentage low so make sure battery percentage was means completely uh, above seventy percent. Always take it as seventy percent. So now simply um, here it is. Wired the a cable and let's connect it. Okay, here it is uh, the cable and simply connect it and connect it to the computer and. Okay. All right. It's now I have connected it, and now open the simply open the bat file, and all the process will automatically start. So simply open the bat file, and the flashing um, completely will takes on uh, the time of the flashing will completely depends on the uh, the storage of the phone. So it's completely on storage. It might be takes five minutes, might be tens, and sometimes fifteen to twenty minutes. So right now the phone was completely flashing, and so and this will automatically start all everything's flashing. and this method will also works if your uh, uh, phone was uh, the IMEI of the phone your null then you require to only flash the modem file uh, to uh, fix the network problem for your phone so uh, it's right now sprang hunk 3 flashing and the sending system okay so let's uh, So it's flashing on. Okay, it seems completed and the phone got reboots and and after the completely flashing the phone uh, to reboot the phone you require to at least wait about 20 minutes. It depends on the 
like uh, storage approx uh, storage of your phone so that's it Now the phone gets on and it's on the welcome screen so this is the way in that way you can easily fix your blank screen problem of Motorola phones and this is the also same method to fix to install stock ROM on your Motorola phones so thanks for watching this video if you like my video then please click on thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe this video thanks for watching this